The Edgewood Colesburg softball team is off to state, and you know it's a big deal when none of the players were even alive to see the last time the Vikings went to Fort Dodge. It's been a 21 year wait, but it was only two years ago when the players say they started noticing a change. She changed the entire atmosphere. She definitely brought a different level of energy. The urgency that we needed. And like, she made us work for everything. She is Taylor Huber. Last summer, the Edco players bought into the first time head coach, and this summer, it's paying off. Just, I mean, I try to bring energy and, you know, keep them up, and they do a good job of, you know, really soaking things in and asking questions, and it's a, it's a really easy group to coach. Two years ago, the Vikings finished with a losing record. This year, they found themselves going toe to toe with defending champion North Lynn in the regional final. In the playoffs against the Lynx, it rarely goes the Vikings' way. No, we've always fell to them, but they're a good team. Oh, God. I don't think we've ever done that, ever. <laughs> At least not since I've been around. A long time, but I knew this was our year to do it, and we were good enough. Not just good enough. The Vikings dominated with a 7 2 victory, never trailing. Claire Alvis made the final out. It was insane. I mean, just like that moment I hit second base and I knew we did it. Like, it was instant tears. I was sobbing like a baby. <laughs> I mean, I was falling too. I don't... The emotion is just wanting it so badly for them. Like, in all their sports, you know, these are all multi-sport athletes on the team, you know, and they've put time into every sport and just seeing it kind of come to fruition for them um, was really special. A former athlete of the week and multi-sport star at Alvernet, Huber says she knows how significant a trip to state can be. I'm 10 years out from that and I still remember like vivid memories of being at the state tournament with my teammates and stuff. So I'm just so happy that they get are going to get to experience all that. It's going to be like amazing. I've been down there to watch my cousins and stuff, but to actually be on the field and for it to be me, it'll be insane. Now the towns of Edgewood and Colesburg are preparing for a week, 21 summers in the making. I just love all the support that we have. I love that people come to our games. It definitely fuels our motivation. Like, when you have that big old crowd, you got to put on a show. I mean, we're going to be the underdogs. I mean, we're coming in as the eight seed, but at this point, I mean, anybody can beat anybody. Everybody down there is good. Everybody down there is playing well right now. So if we hit like we hit the other night and hit against Don Bosco, I mean, we can beat anybody. First pitch.